this is how you change your homepage meta title and meta description on WordPress using Yoast. As we know, one of the most common platforms out there for creating websites is WordPress. Now, probably the most popular plugin for SEO for WordPress websites is Yoast. I want to show you how you should change your page title on your homepage to get the most out of SEO. The first thing that you have to do, as with everything in SEO, is do keyword research. Over here is a snapshot of the keyword research that I've done for a client of ours who owns a car wash business. As you can see, by far the most popular search term, according to Google, is car wash near me. That term alone has got at least 27,000 monthly searches. Now we're going to go into WordPress and obviously Yoast has been installed. The first thing I want to do is go to Yoast, then click on settings. Then click under content homepage settings. And you're going to see that there's a line over there, edit the homepage itself. Click on that button and now you're going to go into the homepage. Scroll down until you see the meta title and the meta description. You're going to see that the standardized page title for Yoast has already been done. But nine times out of ten, this is wrong. The reason is that they've taken the title of your homepage, which most times just says home. And then it gives you your business name. Now, for this example over here, it's not targeting that word that we want, car wash near me. What I want you to do over there is delete that title that it gives me and start incorporating some of the keywords that you're trying to target. This I'm going to relabel this page title. I'm going to say car wash near me in Norwood and four ways. Then I'm going to put a bar and then the name of the website. The reason I've done it this way is obviously to try to put in as many keywords as I can in that title and still make sense. You must remember that with regards to the page title, you still are limited to 60 characters. So you can't just write a whole phone book. The next thing that we're going to do is put a meta description. The meta description is that second line under the page title that gives the reader a bit more information. Again, you want to put your keywords here so Google can see what you're about. I'm going to put in a descriptive meta description with the call to action. Once I've done that, I'm going to press save. Now, the next step would be going to Google Search Console, submit that page, and give it a bit of time so Google can start reading that new page title. Now, many times, especially with the new website, this alone is not going to get you up the search engine straight away. One still has to do backlinking, but at least we've done the page title. And in my opinion, this is the best way to create your page title and your page description with Yoast in WordPress. If you have any questions, drop a comment below.